Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to make hip hop drum beats using virtual instruments in Mixcraft. Uh, first of all, uh, you have to select the drum instruments, go to drums, and select 808 to 909 kit and make sure you enable musical typing if you're if you don't have a MIDI keyboard and um, so basically we are on here right now okay it sounds pretty low and um, low quality so we're going to have to increase the quality by going to effects and selecting classic EQ leave it at full reset and then click edit edit and here we have to add the input we have to increase this to around 12 approximately and let's try this again yeah so it sounds better right now much better and um, yeah so we could also make it sound give it more more of a bass sound here by going to uh, the mixer here's how you go to the mixer this is the mixer so you go here and add a low you tune the low to you tune it up to around 9 db yeah so when it is here let's play it and see much better all right so we're gonna make a beat right now I like usual uh, for hip-hop um, if you don't have um, MIDI control MIDI control keyboard you can always set the beats manually and um, right here we're going to scroll to try to make the beats manually so let's add Let's play this and see. No, that's not what we want. Um, now we have to erase this. Let's see. Let's play this again. Okay. We have to arrange it here. Okay, so let's add the um, hi hats.
let's add here clap. Okay, so here we can try erasing this and see. Okay, so let's try erasing this too and see. Okay, so we can let's see. So now we have hip hop drum beats. We can actually um, put some bass bass drop here by going here and selecting drums, hammer of Thor, hammer of Thor, and um, let's play this and see. First of all, you arm here, you arm it here, and then try playing it. Okay, so it's pretty low and we have to do the same thing that we did for the first track. Go to Classic EQ and Full Reset and then click Edit and increase the volume to 12 or something around there and then so let's try playing this. can try to record this um, since I think this uh, this is not suitable for this so we should try something like synth um, let's go to VSTI instruments and enable uh, some synth here let's say bass in synthesizer uh, it's very loud, very loud, so we could disable uh, the EQ. Okay, so let's try some other preset here. Um, let's try the metal. Um, something better. Okay, we could edit this. Um, uh, no, it's not. I don't. I don't want to ruin this preset, so let's leave it here and let's play this and. Okay, so it seems we have to we have to enable the EQ again, classic EQ. So let's see. Try and um, 
So let's try recording this. Uh, we enabled we enabled metronome so it can guide us in making the beats. So let us record it here. First of all, let's increase this loop here. And then let's try making the bass. So we are here. We can simply cut this part off, the, the ending part, split and um, delete, so that we can make a bit, we can make a loop out of this right here, and um, right click and make a loop. So. Let's see how this sounds. Okay, so this goes into the red, so we have to decrease it a little bit. So let's disable metronome so that we can hear this clearly. Yep, sounds pretty good. And um, so I'm going to save this and I'm going to use this f to make a tutorial on how to make um, on how to make dubstep. Yeah, I'm going to make a tutorial on how to make dubstep. So watch out for that. And um, yeah, be sure to subscribe and I'll talk to you soon. Goodbye.